this is so good the place is in immaculate condition to another exciting weekend video on St. Thomas Redevelopment of course you can find us on Instagram, Facebook and of course we have our PayPal account for those persons who is desirous of contributing to the growth of the channel in terms of the procurement of equipment well with that said uh i'll be heading to soho today via spring garden that is because i am going to look for someone nonetheless you can see the progress on the road uh what is happening this truck in front of me is unloading some rebar that is to the left. Yeah, so I am assuming they're going to use it in the gullies. And the gullies are to the left. As you can see, you can see the gully and you can see the rebars down in the gully. So that is a huge drain. Um, not going any closer because that truck is huge anyway so we are going to Soho today guys and we'll be traveling Spring Garden it has been a very long time that I've used the Spring Garden route and I am hoping that uh, I'll be able to capture very important information information that you guys will like if you are from the area or that area i am soliciting your feedback uh, for those in the states even locally please subscribe so you can get up to the minute information as it relates to the development that is taking place in the parish and the changes that are occurring this is a long gully and this is part of the southern coastal highway improvement project that will run from Marant Bay to Cedar Valley nonetheless um, I will move along slowly because the road is not a hundred percent but just good enough for you guys to take note make observation of what you are seeing I recently made a video about short trip to Seaford and in that video you would have seen uh, related um, contents going to that side so we reach out a place now that they call the Marant a lot of you would have been familiar you can see that the road is being widened and there's a retaining wall that has been constructed um, you can see that it is very long um, but it will basically ensure that the road don't collapse because the whole of that side used to be a gully 
and it only makes sense that them put that kind of infrastructure there because because if you don't or they don't by the time they make the road the road going basically take time eat way and end up in a some river bed so until then guys i am going to make my way to spring garden Welcome back again. I hope you observed the scene with us far. So, as I said, we are going to Soho via Spring Garden. We are not using the C4 road. And uh, this sign in front of us says Reggae Falls to the left and uh, Stony Gut to the right. So we're going to go the Stony Gut Road, which is the same as going to Spring Guard. So you see the sign? And it says 50 kilometer. So we're going to use this route, guy. Hope you guys will love the video. The place feel and looks cool. So we'll make you get some of that. A nice view of Spring Garden Road heading in the direction of Stony Gut. We are going to Soho today, as I tell you. And this is what it looks like the area is cool. Yeah. Yeah, so we are in the country guys. You know you're the country when you can get these views. Alright? And here comes a taxi. And we're heading to Spring Garden. Play school here, man. Look on the floor on the fauna. Alright, stop. As I said, we are in Spring Garden, heading towards um, Soho. But what I notice is that the road here is a lot better than the the what you would say the the, the, the main road. And you know this is good because. Not to say it's better than the main road is good, but the fact that there's a lot of farmers who cultivate this area, the fact that there is a lot of persons living in this community, hard-working people, this community is very quiet, you don't hear stupid violence that you would associate with the city occurring in these areas and so 
when I say, you know, it's a nice journey, them bamboo, they look really nice. You know, see the inner of the country. So, yeah, nice scenery. Hope you guys love it. Tell me what to think about the view. Back in the days, I used to use bamboo as a child to make like raft. And of course, when I apple season, we make things like pop guns. You know, if you pop gun is something where you use a, 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 a cylindrical section of the bamboo, the bamboo plant, and you use a bamboo rod and you force an apple blossom into it and then you 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 push it and then it makes a popping sound so I refer to that as a pop gun um so one could easily argue that Jamaica's culture for guns and stuff like that may very well start there nonetheless um We are heading further into the district. Um, why? Not much person I've seen on the road so far. I, 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 I guess the, 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 the COVID number in this community must be extremely low, if not non existent, because I, I can't see other than vehicles driving seeing that everybody's home you can see clothes and line and uh, oh here's one person and she's talking on her phone anyway we head further into spring garden and uh, that gate looks so nice white and clean freshly paint yeah so I hope you guys like this video um, it's the first of its kind um, I don't remember having seen any video stating or documenting the spring garden route let alone going to Soho. So for those persons living in this area, you have families overseas. You have family and friends, different places. You can just share the WhatsApp video with them, especially for those persons who, you know, are going to appreciate things like this. Oh, look for the command fall upon the road. Long time in the sun, you know, man. When my boy, you know, man, not my grandmother, but a lady I spent some time with, she used to get them eggs. And a one or two times, I supposed to eat the rooster. The rooster come and fall. One thing I know, it was tough. The bone was very tough, but it was nice. It was somewhat. It tastes different, it tastes authentic. Anyway, as you can see, the banana plants along the road, a lot of banana plants passing Faith Temple Church. So, who used to attend that church down? Know, leave a comment in the, this, in the, the comment section and tell me what you think. We're on our way to. So oh, via Spring Garden. One thing as I said the road is good. I have no issue as it relates to swerving from potholes. Nothing like that. So that this is very good. I could go faster, but when you are doing or when you are doing your your 
your, your, your my learner's license. Yeah, so once you're in a built up area or community, you're not supposed to go more than 30, 30 kilometers. So you have to take precaution. You can't speed because you see good road. You know? If you have bike problem. Anyway, the road is good so far. I like it. Um, very smooth. Houses them look nice. And yeah, I like what I see. You know, I like it. Very good. Um, there's a section that says, Welcome to Stony God. If you guys want me to, alright, I'm going to just take one short detour and go down with Stony God. This is Stony God. It points to Stony God. I've never been down here, but we just uh, go down the road. So, for all of those persons who say, Oh, how you go to Spring Garden and you don't go Stony God? So, uh, based on what we know, we know that Paul Bogle came from this area. Um, and in the wow, my god, it's really stony gut. Anyway, this hill is super steep, but I fall out and then make gonna just get a quick view of what stony gut is like. Honestly, this was not in my plan, but the fact that I passed through Spring Garden, you know that Paul Bogle um, is known for being a freedom fighter, for fighting for, you know, rights of Africans, uh, Jamaican Africans in those days. Oh, so this is where it ends. So this is Stony Gut, and we see a thing says Stony Gut Chapel. Oh, so this is how Stony Gut look. Now go, now go, just take a spin around and then make gonna see what it is like. This look good, man. So guys, this is a Stony Gut Chapel. And everything look exciting out there, man. It look nice and clean and well preserved. But now I'm going to stop, but I just have to take a picture so I can see what I'm going Wow. So this says Stony Got Village. What? <laughs> At first, I come here all these years, so. Apparently this is Stony God Chapel. The, the, well, not this building, but the sign. You want me to capture you in our video? You don't want that. <laughs> I <can't. laughs> don't want people to identify easily, you know. Anyway, so it says Stony God Chapel. And you guys can pause the video and take a good read. Read, um, it says Stony God Chapel. Religion was an integral part of the right, excellent Paul Bogle's life as a deacon in Native Baptist Church. The right, excellent George William Garden was also closely tied to this mission. Garden opened churches across St. Thomas, Bath, Spring Garden, Sunny Hill. Paul Bogle, as garden superintendent was a leader in the native baptist church for several years prior to his ordination on march 5th 1865 a long time that you know guys here the, me, me just i read it for the importance so you no know guys can see what well, go on nonetheless um, Stony God Chapel was originally named Island or Highland Castle. Church was opened in 1864 and was christened by George William Garden. So, guys, 
you can say that these men were Christians, God fearing people. Why? Look at the place where it looked majestic, beautiful. I never knew I would be able to. You know, this is history. It looks beautiful. I love it. Wow. This is so good. The place is in immaculate condition. Like it's properly kept. Wow. Of course, guys, this is a Jamaican apple tree. On it, you have apple and so on. My God. The place is so serene, so beautiful. These are the things that St. Thomas has to offer. And you don't, you see, with this road that we are going to get, it's going to be very interesting. You see, these are monuments. Honestly, I would have loved if there was someone here to, you know, give a little tour. And the sad truth is, I born and grew at St. Thomas. And I never, ever, came to Stony God. You know, and I am going to assume I am not the only person who born in this area but somehow has never been able to experience all of this. And there is a monument Oh boy, and hello, it sounds undisturbed, peaceful. And in the head says, Here lies the remain. Um, I don't want to make any mistake, you know. Why, this is humbling, you know, just what, yeah. Um, read it now. It seems like it's a monument. You know, some things, you know, it's humbling. You know, you, you learn about it and you, 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 you were taught about it in high school, but you really never get the, the true meaning or experience until you actually visit the site and it just so serene <sighs> wow my gosh i love it so basically the monument behind us uh is just to memorialize the memory of Paul Boga right? and the brutal oppression the people faced then and oh oh the house of worship was there where he lived so guys you know some things are sacred to me and you know really want to put it on you know, YouTube, nonetheless, you kind of get an idea of what the environment is like. All we know it's pristine. Pristine. Mm. 
pristine. I love it. If you don't love here, I don't know. Why? If you know, I'm gonna come back, make a visit. Wanna tell me? But it is beautiful. Mm. Mm. No, it's so boring, you know. Stony got village. Yeah, beautiful. So guys, if we don't come St. Thomas and you want to visit Stony God Village, take a walk. It's beautiful. That's all I can say. Anyway, I'm going to head on to Sour. So we're heading back. As I said, we're going to Sour. And the road is sort of steep. But... I can't manage it. So, that was an experience. First time going to Stony Gut. Uh, you know, it's so bad, yeah? Yeah. Humbling. <sighs> Those were the days of a great sacrifice those men made for us. Stony God. Mm -hmm. So we are back on our way heading to Soko. Oh, the road get all of a sudden just get bad here so anyway you can see that taxis are working for those persons who have this experience tell us about it Tell me what you think. It's, oh, so you remember me always telling something like I was on a hill, was a property over here, so and that is where me always aspire myself to know that one from like build a house, but that little perch at the end. Yeah, so back to the video going to so over here. Spring Garden. As you can see, it's a farming community. Um, a lot of coconuts, uh, banana, aki mango, um, All that is banana. So, guys, this, well, going to Stony Gut was a sober and a humbling experience. Why? Anyway, But we 
head deeper into Whitehall. Well, this is not Whitehall. This is still Spring Garden, I think, because we are heading towards Soho and a farmer man with them goat them. Yes, boss, then look healthy and good, man. Respect, man. Why? Why manage so much of them, man? Oh, you're not here. I respect them, you're here. <laughs> so, him, him, him not here. He has an hearing impediment. Nonetheless, um, Middleton and we are going to pass Middleton Primary School so we own Spring Garden we are in oh so this road to the left is Pop Stonycut I did not know that I thought it was just Stony Gut <laughs> ah Rasta Wagon you know, eat jackfruit. <laughs> Nonetheless, you know, respect, you know, brother. Blessed I am. Give thanks, man. <laughs> so, that was a gentleman. He had a jackfruit on his head and he's selling it. Unfortunately, my passenger does not eat jackfruit. She do not eat what? Jackfruit, avocado. I don't understand what kind of vegetarian you be. <laughs> I mean, why? You're funny, bad. Anyway, you're supposed to eat them something they can you know, eat. Meat and them things there. You're supposed to eat every available fruit you can get your hands on. Why? I want. Anyway. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> we are on the journey to Soho via Spring Garden, and as you can see, we have we took a short trip to um, they call it Stony Gut. So that is one way that we took you, and not via the route of. C4. So the road not bad. The road is not bad at all. Not bad. Think them. Someone mix up some aggregate like them are the same casting. Yeah. Subscribers, I would like to big up. You have like Bonnie, 
and these are just a few that comes to mind you now Johnson you have okay. so all of you saw Middleton yeah. Middleton too. so And uh, uh, clean it up. Yeah. So we are about uh, a minute and well, we are about 59 seconds away from Soko. So progressing smoothly, same way. You guys know the here give your feedback um, thank you for supporting thank you for subscribing as we made the journey today to so um, really appreciate you know going to Stony Good for the first time you know, it's a sobering environment, so you understand. I appreciate the sacrifice persons made, guys. Subscribe to the channel. Look forward to next week for another exciting content. We are officially in Sydney, according to that um, sign right here. So, thank you very much. Bless up, bless up, bless up. Wonderful weekend. All right.